this video is for any of you who are having issues logging into Blackboard and filling out your application. So, um, if you have not logged in at all, um, you will see um, when you go to www.ccbc.edu, um, you will see this screen. And then up here, way in the corner, you click on My CCBC and pull down to My CCBC Login. And if it's the first time you're logging in, you can click Get My Login Information. And you can use any of these four things. Most of you will know um, at least two of these four things. So you pick two of them and submit and they will give you your login. Once you get your login, you set your own password. So once you get your login and your password, you can go back up to the My CCBC, and then you log in with Blackboard. And to use all of the um, resources through CCBC, you use the same login and password. So then you go to Courses, and so, if you are just applying at this point, the courses that you will see is, will just be the application. So, to apply, um, here is the um, Essex application for sleep technology. Um, you would click on this if you're applying to Essex. This is for the out-of-state application where it says O. Okay, so here's the in-state Essex application. Click on here. And so, once you click there, you will see that there is a menu on the left-hand side. And what you want to go to is Submit Admission Materials. So here are your application directions. And what you have to do to complete your application, are, it, it's three things. You have to um, submit a proof of high school graduation. So you either need a high school diploma, GED, or college transcript. You need to submit the technical standards and submit the application. So if you open up the application, and it will open up in a writable Word document, you fill out the Word document, and then you save it to your desktop. After you completely fill it out and you save it to your desktop with your name as part of the um, title so you go to file and then save as and then I'm going to save it to this PC into my desktop all the way up here and it says seed health application put your name in front of it and then save it that way. And then once you're finished filling it out, you go click up here where it says Submit Application, and then you scroll down to Browse My Computer, and then go back to where you saved it, and mine will be under Rachel Newman, um, Health Seed application right here. And I open that, and that'll be listed right here. And then way over here in the corner, it has Submit. It's just out of the scope of my camera right now. And then once you hit Submit, I receive that directly to this application. So that's one of the things that you have to do. And you do the same um, exact process for submitting proof of your high school graduation. So you can either um, take a picture of it and save it to your desktop or um, scan it or whatever it is that you can do and upload it. And it's you upload it the same way. Um, you click on it and then browse your computer, upload it, and hit submit. The last thing that you do is to read, need to read our technical standards. So you open that up in a Microsoft Word document as well. And 
this is just the things, um, a list of the things that you need to be able to accomplish as a sleep technician in the job that you have to do. So you print this out, you sign the bottom, and then you either scan it in or take a picture of it and then upload it. So here are the directions that will go through all of this step by step and we'll discuss everything step by step. And then here are the three items that you need to do. Submit proof of high school graduation, submit technical standards, and submit application. If you have any more questions outside of this, feel free to give me a call or send me an email and I will help you out with anything further. Good luck.